Hi there, everybody. Welcome to Fratton Park for our featured game today. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. The game has all the elements really to excite us, and I'm sure it will live up to the billing. It's Portsmouth against Arsenal. Well, there's certainly a buzz in this stadium in the uh, minutes leading up to kickoff. I hope the match doesn't disappoint. I don't think it will. We've got a couple of attacking sides here. Number four. Well, we expect goals today, and if we expect them from anyone in particular, it'll be Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Yeah, I think that's fair to say. Great pace, even though he's uh, been around the scene for a long time now, but uh, still difficult to keep up with when he stretches those legs. Of course, we've brought the FA Cup back here to Fratton Park in 2008, and they were a Premier League team, of course, for a number of years, but fell to the fourth tier of English football, but... Great scenes of celebration here in 2017 when they started their way back up the ladder again. Yeah, they've uh, endured plenty of bad times, but you have to take your hat off to these fans. They continue to turn up in the thousands and you can always hear that bloke ringing his bell from behind the goal. In recent times with Arsenal, Alan, there's been a, a certain amount of discontent from certain sections of the Arsenal support. Is there an entitlement that they feel that they should be winning the, uh, the Premier League when, of course, they haven't uh, since 2004? I'm not sure it's an entitlement, but they want to see this team compete better at the top of the Premier League in the way that they haven't in recent years. off here first half is up and running and here is the Portsmouth lineup for this game well we think Alan it'll be a 4-5-1 formation which can look a bit negative yeah but you look at the players in that five that midfield five and I think a couple at least will be trying to support the lone front man Danny Ceballos Obama Yang this is the away team lineup Bernd Leno starts in goal. Lucas Torreira starts with Danny Ceballos in the centre of midfield. And the main striker is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Now he can cross it. And he's just cut it out in the nick of time, the crucial moment. Chance to go at the opposition with pace. Good vision. Had to be brave coming out there, the goalkeeper. No one's picking him up in the wide area. He's dangerous. Got to be. A oh, great work by the keeper. So Arsenal get their corner. swung in, punches it away. That shot's blocked very quickly. It'll be a throw, no nonsense clearance from the defender. Now Lucas Torreira, Obama yeah. Is this the moment? Please move it immediately, thank you. Put in the corner. Good work by the goalkeeper. Naylor. Curtis. That's a great interception. He's got skill with the ball, backing himself in these circumstances. Now Lucas Torreira, now Danny Ceballos. Keeping the ball is one thing, but they've got to try and open up the opposition. 
Tries to shove here. Confident goalkeeping here. Yeah, good hand to turn it aside. It's a corner for Arsenal here. Corner played into the middle. And this is going to be a throw. Now he could play it into the danger area. Obama Yang. Now Lucas Torreira. Nelson. Ceballos. Obama Yang with a lovely pass. Brilliant goal! In truth, Alan, this is what we expected. A dominant side, and they're showing that on the scoreline. Yeah, we don't always get what we expect, but uh, they've been good value here. They've played well, particularly the strikers. Arsenal, as you would expect, have gone in front. Read the play well to intercept. Portsmouth throw. Naylor. Burgess. Nail. Got his foot in to cut out the pass. Arsenal's turn now to get at the opposition. And the referee blows his whistle. The flag was up for offside. between these two. Well, they couldn't keep possession, they've given it away. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. And it's Arsenal holding a slender advantage as we count down towards half-time. Still a few questions for them to answer in this game. Nelson. Patient play from them. Guided through. Obama Young. The keeper stopped. Real chance. Oh, what a fine goal. They lead by two now. They'll feel a little bit more comfortable in their good value for this advantage at the moment. Just a word on the goal scorer. You have to get there to get the chance. And credit him for that. Well, I think the keeper, you know, he's entitled to ask why his defenders didn't react as quickly as the goal scorer. He'd done his bit, he'd made the initial save. Just widen the margin here to 2 0.
Danny Ceballos. Here's Torreira. Well, that's half time. And 2 0 is the score at the halfway mark. Well, this guy looks like he's the one the opposition having the most problems with. He is. He's managed to carve out plenty of shooting opportunities. Really has tested the keeper and got himself a goal. Referee just checking everything is in order. And he blows for the second half to start. Here's Torreira. Nelson. Saw the pass and dealt with it. Naylor. And Arsenal have possession. They've won it. Yeah, well, Arsenal certainly having enough of the ball here. The way they've played, the way they've been clinical in front of goal, it's difficult to see a way back the opposition if they can continue in this vein they've been so good out here today blocked off the pass there Arsenal attacking well with width here coming in from the flank dangerously Obama Young and there it is for Arsenal increased really with this goal well you can only see more goals coming their way the way they played let's have another peek at that goal say it's so one-sided today but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals they read the opponent's mind and got the ball and that's when you need the defender to show his class and he's done just that Aubameyang, that's what they're trying to do Keeper not taking any chances Not wanting to catch that one He's punched it away We've reached the hour mark Half an hour to go Naylor, excellent attacking play here They could open up the opposition now Aim for those in the middle Only partially away from danger Easy for the goalkeeper When really there was every chance of him being totally beaten then He's got the ball. Yeah, he was exposed there, and uh, he must have thought he was going to get beaten, but, well, the lad just made a real hash of it, didn't he? Good stuff from Arsenal. When they get it wide, they look good. Take the corner. Portsmouth are going to make a switch. Corner's taken. And that header takes the ball out of play. A chance to whip it in here. Well, they're keeping the pressure on with all these corners. Substitution coming up for Portsmouth. A short corner. The target. Players in the centre. Defenders done well here to clear the danger.
Ceballos. Danny Ceballos. And there was danger, but he's cleared it. Danny Ceballos. Here's Torreira. Difficult for the defender against the player who wants to take him on like this. Ceballos. Albana, yeah. Can he clear his lines now? The chance to break away now on the counter. Treads it through. Intercepted here. Referee has blown and he's given the free kick. Portsmouth are going to make a switch. Ceballos. Here's Torreira. He's got some room out here in the wide position. The build up is patient. Ah, oh, he's taken it away there with a very good tackle. Can they find Aubameyang? That's what they're trying to do. There's still danger here after this half clearance. And on the clock, eight more minutes. Deflected out for a throw. Ceballos. Aubameyang. Intercepted well. Danny Ceballos. Now Lucas Torreira. But this could be an opportunity. In behind the defence. Abana Yang. And that's dealt with the problem. The and we're hearing there will be three added minutes here. Have added time. Here's Socrates Papastatopoulos. Aubameyang. Got the ball back. And that's it, last blast on the whistle from the referee. Well, look at that scoreline. And it emphasises what we've seen in the shape of the game as well. Very one-sided. Well, from the first whistle, they were on top of it never altered the entire 90 minutes. Wonderful stuff.